Hello YouTubers, uh, it's Robert Brizendine 5 back with another lovely trade confirmation. I believe uh, this one's from MTG Pokemon, I think. Yeah. Yeah, it's got a unique uh, street address. That's not how I recognize it. So, um, I think I sent him like an Olivia Valderon and a couple other things. A whole bunch of angels for his his fiance is uh, Angel Collection, some some other random stuff. I, I'm not entirely too sure, but uh, let's uh, see what's in here. I think it was like a... I don't remember what the trade was for. So uh, it'll be new for all of us and exciting. Uh, glad I got so much positive uh, feedback about my video yesterday. I think I just cut his note. And, oh, no, I didn't cut his note. Uh, it says, hey Robert, thanks for trading again. Hope you enjoy your cards. I look forward to trading again sometime. MTG Pokemon. That's awesome. Thanks, man. I love notes. Um, like I was saying, I'm happy ooh, that I got so much positive feedback on my little video yesterday. Um, it, it makes me happy to see that there's very, there, there's a large population of like-minded people in this community. Um, especially like Rocks, Box, and 90s response. That was a, it's very good. I like that. Um, and I like him agree. I mean, I like him, you know, uh, also think that, you know, there needs to be more people speaking out about said issues. But, uh, let's, uh, see what's in here. Oh, this thing is well packaged. <laughs> All right. I think he's getting getting me back for uh, the gorilla tape that I uh, sent him on our first trade. When I traded him that uh, feast and famine for his uh, Liliana. <laughs> All right. Oops. Okay. So that looks like extras, and this looks like the trade. Yep, so uh, only trade confirmation for the day. I'm expecting a couple others. I'm still waiting on one from a certain someone who uh, keeps getting distracted by Skyrim, and it's starting to piss my ass off. You're all going to see a, an angry California boy here pretty <laughs> soon. No, they won't see that. Uh, but I'm hoping he's still not distracted by Skyrim because that's just a, it's just a retarded excuse. Um, so I keep checking my camera because it uh, has a bad habit of dying. So, okay, let me get this out. We'll call it good. But yeah, no, I yeah. am. I've stopped getting the uh, the offensive messages of uh, undercutting cards and whatnot, so at least my video did some good, I'm hoping. <laughs> anyway, so the trade was for a Grave Titan, which is in uh, very good condition. I think it's a M11. No, nope, M12, I'm sorry. M12, Grave Titan. A Sun Titan, which is going to go into my EDH deck to replace some stuff. Um, just a good good card. Uh, a Gideon Jura. Just need an extra one. And this one is going to go into my Tezzeret Control deck. This is really cool. This is a uh, full art Treasure Mage. It's a sweet looking card. I'd actually like to get a few more of this one. It's a really cool card. Um, and let's see, as extras, he sent, ah, as extras, he sent a signed forest, a little pokeball, a tree, um, a card I don't, I can't read, uh, it's, it appears to be a Japanese something, so... I'll have to go and look in by block, but uh, go into like findmagiccards.com or something and look it up. 
by the uh, block symbol. A <laughs> Hey, exploit and golem. I have a whole bunch of this one. This one's a foil. That's a cool foil, though. I like the foil job. And probably one of my favorite uh, land retrieval cards, Harrow. Uh, especially uh, if you avoid to avoid counter spells, do it at the end of someone's turn, or at the end of your no, at the end of someone's turn. On someone's turn. I'm sorry, I'm I'm tired of trying to collect my thoughts here. I'm kind of miffed about the uh, trade I was supposed to get that was delayed by Skyrim. It's bothering me. Anyway. So, MTG Pokemon, a very safe trader, uh, sent some sweet extras, um, sent in some shiny sleeves. Um, everyone should check him out. Nice guy. Um, you know, he's got some good stuff. Um, and I think I will be, uh, probably be posting a couple other videos here and there. I, I, I've been toying around with, uh, like a discussion type thing and, you know... I've been talking to some friends and doing some kind of like, I don't know, I guess you call it some like newbie podcast or something like that, or, I don't know. Anyway, um, once again, MTG, MTG Pokemon Safe Trader, um, everyone should check him out and, uh, you know, um, like, comment, subscribe, you know, send me hate mail, whatever. Uh, and I will probably be back with either some kind of random, random video or whatnot, doing some kind of review of some whatnot. I, I may go into, like, branch off a bit and do... I actually had an interesting idea for a video I, I've been toying with. Um, you know, I, I had an Xbox 360. I would love, I want to know what you guys think. I had an Xbox 360 for less than a year. I think, I think I didn't even have it for six months before the thing got the damn red ring of death. And, uh, you know, I, I opened the thing up and it turns out that the heat sink pulled away from the GPU and yada, 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 because they didn't design it to stand on its end. Bear in mind, it was one of the older Xbox 360s. Uh, they didn't design it to stand up on its end, a lot like the PlayStation 3, which I got the day they came out and have never had a problem with my first gen PS3. So... Anyway, uh, I was uh, toying with the idea of going up to the local uh, shooting range and unloading some um, Sabbat slugs into it. You know, just because uh, it's a piece of shit. <laughs> yeah, I, I know people like Xbox and whatnot, but... Uh, everyone I know has given up on their Xboxes. I know one dude who bought, like, four Xboxes. But, uh... I think I may do that. I'm not sure yet, though. The weather's kind of crappy up here. So, and the shooting range, I need a four-wheel drive truck to get to it, and I currently don't have access to one. Anyway, but I mean, if anyone would like to see that, maybe I'd do it in the future. I have, an, I have my Xbox in my garage still. Anyway, uh, thank you for sticking around for my rantings, my ravings, and whatnot. Um, I will see you next time. Once again, rate, comment, subscribe. MTG, MTG Pokemon is a very safe trader. Uh, everything came in safe and timely. And the Grave Titan and the Gideon may possibly be up for trade. Don't ask me yet until it goes in my binder, but it may. Um, I'm not sure yet. I may do some trade-ins to ABU so I can get a bunch of older booster packs and do some openings. Anyway, take it easy.